Hey everyone, uh, welcome back. I just wanted to make a quick video of our 2023 Model Y with Hardware 4 uh, Park Assist feature. I wanted to test it out, how, how well it was as gauging how close an object is. I wanted to do it at night. I, I haven't seen too many people try to do the vision only Park Assist at night. Typically it's during the day, so I thought this would be more interesting. Uh, I'm pulling up a little after midnight, but you're about to see with the first test, I get a, a message saying Park Assist is, is loading, uh, which I thought was a bit odd. We we're already moving. So I give it a couple more seconds, creep forward just a little bit more, and you'll see uh, another error message actually come up. Yeah, front camera blocked, uh, so it's saying Park Assist is uh, degraded. So I decided to just kind of abort that attempt, uh, so I back up a little bit, and then I, I try again. No error messages this time, which is great. To be perfectly honest, I get a little scared here, about 17, 18 inches away, because uh, I don't trust it too much yet. We just got the vehicle. I think we picked it up on the 20th. I was filming this on the, the 22nd. Uh, so a little I'm skittish with it uh, right now, but uh, I apologize in advance. I'm about to completely fumble the measuring tape here. It takes me a moment to, to, to get it in hand, so sorry about that. But uh, let's take a look to see how well it, how well it did. Pretty good, actually. I believe it said 17, 18 inches. I'm gonna get a little closer, I believe, with the camera, uh, but I, it, it's pretty much spot on at 18 inches. Uh, I get a little closer there. Yeah, 18 inches. That, it was pretty fantastic. Uh, I did have to do a second attempt, like you guys saw, there was a, an error message, uh, park assist loading, and then the image was degraded. Um, but backing up and trying again, second attempt, 18 inches, right on the dot. So this next attempt, though, I wanted to throw it kind of a curveball. I try park assist uh, with the headlights off to see how well it does. So let's take a look here. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed there that sometimes i've seen at least in the hardware 3 models sometimes when you're in park and i put it in drive it says park assist loading and it doesn't tell you if anything's in front of you right away uh it did as soon as i took it from park put it in reverse it, it showed that there was an object in front of me 17 8 in, 17 18 inches away which i thought was pretty neat but here we go giving it a shot without headlights It's freaking out a little bit, giving messages saying that the uh, the park assist is degraded. So as you can see, I got I kind of awarded that. I didn't want to get too close. Uh, I was actually fairly close, um, and I didn't want to get too, uh, closer. I was, obviously, I didn't want to run into this. I think it's a uh, some type of storage container container. Sorry, outside of Target. Uh, but there we go. Let's go ahead and jump out and test this. But it definitely looks like headlights are obviously required, um, so it doesn't see too well. Okay, I, I was actually further away than I thought I was. Um, I was just, I was nervous. Can you blame me though? And okay, this time around, pretty far off. But there you have it. 
I just want to test it at night, give it throw a curveball with uh, without any headlights. But I hope you enjoyed, and let me know in the comments if you uh, want me to try anything else, any other tests. Thanks for watching.